Hi, my name is Hassi Brafi Kuzuman, and I'm a data center technical consultant engineer in the customer experience organization at Cisco. This video will provide steps on how to use Ansible to claim Nexus devices in Cisco InterSight, which may also be referred to as using an automated approach. Please note that all links and commands discussed in this video will be available in the description of this video. Please refer to the companion video titled Nexus Switch InterSight Device Connector for an overview of InterSight for Nexus and how to manually claim Nexus devices in InterSight. InterSight is a free cloud connectivity feature for Cisco data center products. As is the case for manually claiming Nexus devices in InterSight, NXOS software version 10.23F or later is required for claiming through automation Nexus devices using Ansible for InterSight. Now let's go over on how to run the Ansible playbook. The Ansible InterSight Nexus template is available from the following GitHub link. The following four tasks are required to complete this endeavor. 1. Run the Ansible playbook from a desktop with access to the Nexus device. 2. Access to the InterSight web portal. 3. The configured Nexus InterSight Ansible playbook. 4. The updated inventory.yaml file with the required dependencies from the GitHub location. The contents of the inventory.yaml file will need to be modified according to your Nexus device connectivity requirements to your network. GitHub also describes the key variables, the requirements needed, and the syntax on how to run Ansible to claim the Nexus devices in InterSight. Do not modify the playbook.yaml file as this contains the base code to claim Nexus devices. However, you can view the contents from GitHub. Your desktop environment requires you to copy the ansible.cfg, inventory.yaml, playbook.yaml, the requirements.yml files, and the secret key into your working directory. You will need to copy the secret key generated from the InterSight portal into your working directory as described previously. To obtain the InterSight API key, log into InterSight.com, go to System, Settings, API Keys, and create the required key by clicking on the Generate API Key button. Now you will go to the CLI of the Nexus switch and verify that the device has not been claimed by using the Show System Device Connector Claim Info command. We will now verify that the working directory in our desktop has all the required files, view the contents of the inventory.yaml file, and run the Ansible playbook. Once the command is run, it will not take long, if all is correct, to finish the claim process. Once the Ansible playbook has ran successfully, you can go back to the Nexus CLI and verify that the device has been claimed. You can also see this in the InterSight web portal. This concludes the video on claiming Nexus devices using Ansible in Cisco InterSight. Thanks for watching.